What's up, Star Man Crew? Welcome back to the channel. And if it is your first time here, then welcome to the channel. Today is part two of opening this, our booster box for Evolving Skies. Now, as I mentioned in the last video, I do do it in two parts because it is kind of expensive to do all for one video, but I'm very excited to show you what comes in this as our last pack opening was some heat. But we can jump right into this. I just ask that if you like what you see, that you hit that like button and that subscription button because they both help me out a lot. And let's get into this thing right now. All right, so we went through the box last time, all the art on it. So again, check that out if you would like to see that. But we will get through our next set of packs, which is a chalk full of them. And when I tell you that last half was some heat, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we get another alternate art again. If you have not watched it, I do suggest that you do. If, <laughs> if it wasn't my channel, and trust me, I've already watched this video probably like six times by now. I would watch it again. Um, let's go with some fire energy to start and let's go on that call. Um, again, we're looking for the Rayquaza cards because that is the deck that I'm building. A Mareep will be part of it, but I already have enough for my deck. A CDOT and a gold rare boost shake. Let's go on our first pack of the day. This is insane. Oh my goodness. And this is a cool card too. Wow, look at the shining glitter on that. I am, oh. Now again, I mentioned in the last video, I usually have prices, but I will not today because these prices fluctuate. This right now could be a like $45 card just because, and in like three weeks, it'll be like a $10 card. So who knows? We're just gonna appreciate the art today because the artist worked so hard on that and they decided to bless me with a gold rare. So we have pulled an alternate art, and we pulled a gold rare out of this one booster box. Now, when I tell you I'm excited to get into my second one because I did buy two, I'm just, oh, let's go with Psychic Energy Lightning. I'm just so excited, really. Um, now, really, I do want to pull those Rayquaza cards because I don't want to have to buy them individually because when you first start off, these cards are expensive. So there's the boost shake that we got the gold from and a Talon Flame or gold of. Um, now as we go through this, I just ask that you comment your favorite pull of the day. And if you have had a chance to get your hands on some of these, um, as I mentioned in the last video, which I'm gonna probably say a lot because I do repeat myself a good amount when I talk. Um, I try not to, I try to keep things fresh and fun and I, I do as best I can. I think I do a pretty good job. Hold on, let me just move there real quick. Uh, water energy, and I kind of saw it as it was flipping. Um, but you are able to get your hands on sets early if you go to a card shop that does Pokemon tournaments. So it does actually come out tomorrow, which is Friday, as a Rourke and a Sharpedo. Um, but I did buy this from a card shop by me and they get it on Monday because they do tournaments. And that is where I play at my tournaments. Um, Playing the TCG has been a lot of fun. That is why I am keeping the code cards. I am so sorry. Last time I did throw one in, so I could throw in another one today. You never know. Let's go with Fighting Energy. Ooh, very nice. Um, you never know, you never know. Hopefully I will because I'm probably gonna forget that I am trying to keep them for myself um, because I am playing the TCGO. A Lilligant. Very cool. This Rayquaza, I need your Rayquaza. I'm gonna call it. This Rayquaza pack is going to have a Rayquaza V in it. Not gonna call the VMAX, and I'm going specific for you. So that's how you know, that's how you know I'm gonna get this card. I'm gonna get exactly what I asked for. Let's go with Fire Energy. So far, so far, so good. I'm calling it good here. Um, I was wishing that there would be a Charizard in this set, but there can't be a Charizard in every set. It would make it less special. Switching Cups and a Drampa, so no call. That's all right, unfortunate, but whatever. Um, I'm really hoping for my sake that, or for my collection, that we get the Umbreon alternate art. Now, I don't know what the second half is really gonna look like. Like we have already seen, we have gotten a gold card, but we did pull an alternate art last time, so let's go with Psychic. Um, so I don't know what the odds are of getting two all arts in a uh, booster box. Now, we could totally get Vs and Vmaxes as we've only gotten like one or two of those, a Golduck and an Umbreon V. So exactly what I was talking about. I should have made a call on this one, but it is not the alternate art. Um, I did pull this in Japanese with the set EV Heroes. So it is a beautiful, beautiful card. The centering is actually very, very nice. A little bit damaged at the top, which is kind of unfortunate. I've noticed that a little bit in this set so far is that the cards are a little damaged. Um, kind of unfortunate. Uh, Pokemon Company always seems to be having, oops, 
hopefully you didn't spoil that, um, seems to be having some issues when it comes to Lightning Energy, their packaging. Um, in recent years, uh, I've had packs that were basically open by the time I got them, um, and they were freshly sealed, or the uh, boxes were sealed. And a Jolteon VMAX, let's go! I've actually, I think I've almost pulled every single Eevee, Eeveelution. I think, what would I be missing? I think I'm missing Flareon. Flareon is the only one that I am missing um, out of all of them. Wow, that is insane. Good for me. <laughs> oh my goodness, I am so, so excited. Um, this set really, really has me so hyped. The next set that's coming out is Celebration, so let's go with Fire Energy. Um, is Celebrations, and Celebrations is going to be a very nostalgic set. Very excited to play in the pre-release for that, because I don't even know what it'll be like, since it's a reprint of a bunch of old cards. Slokith and a Hyd Hydreigon. Nice holographic. Um, but they're bringing back some light cards, I think dark cards as well. The base set Charizard that everybody has been searching after is going to have a 25th anniversary one. There's going to be like eight different Pikachu prints. Uh, we'll go with Lightning for Pikachu. Not there. Um, Stormy Mountains, good card, in my opinion, because <laughs> I need it for my deck. Um, double Swablu and a Smeargle. So yeah, this is oh, this is so awesome. Um, this set in particular, though, seems to be good uh, for people who are playing competitive. So if you do play the TCG, which I suggest you do if you haven't already, let's give you this one. You can have that one. Enjoy. Enjoy. I hope you get something good. Uh, we'll go with Leaf Energy, Lightning. So if you do play the PT, uh, the trading card game, I think it's awesome. Let me know in the comments uh, what deck you are excited to play. But if not, I suggest that you get into it. It's very easy as we ruin this pack, um, <laughs> which is okay. Um, we move into our second half of these packs. And I hope that I'm not rushing through this too much. I'm going to assume that if you're watching my channel that you're watching other channels. Could be a bad assumption, but I hope that you're enjoying the art. Uh, I would be going slow. Let's go with Psychic Energy. Ooh, very nice. Um, I do try to take my time a little bit, but at the same time, I'm opening a booster box all in one day. And assuming that you've seen other videos like this, I don't think that you would need to see all the art. Hip Hippodon and a Statlant, which actually is a really nice Statlant. That art's, that art's sick. Um... Uh, what was I saying? Oh yes, that I hope that you're enjoying the art, but I am going a little bit quicker only because I don't like to drag out my videos. Um, I try to stay under 20 minutes, uh, under 15 if I can. Let's go with Leaf Energy. Um, just because I know that not everyone has like all day to be watching videos and I am opening up some cards that hopefully if you cannot collect that you're enjoying my collection, Rag and Rolla and Altaria, which I like that. Um, and I'm excited to show it to you, trust me. And this is all for my documentation too. I don't just do YouTube for the numbers and for views and whatever, like the views are nice. I want monetization because I want to do bigger projects for all of you and for me. Let's go with Leaf Energy. I think I've guessed Leaf on the past three. Um, but at the same time, I know that your attention may want to be somewhere else. And I'm so thankful that you all watch, but I'm not going to make you sit there a half an hour of me opening up cards when you could be doing something else. Um, whether it be productive, I hope that you're enjoying the 15 minutes and I try to make them as enjoyable as possible. But at the same time, I don't wanna waste your time, uh, you know, taking times between packs, doing all this stuff, talking too much, going on tangents, let's go with fire energy, which I do, I definitely do, don't get me wrong, but I just, you know, I try to keep it on a time time restraint. Uh, restraint. Blah. Sometimes I also can't talk, as you can tell. Twimple, a low tad, and a jump bluff. Actually, really, really cute. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, we have four packs left. Again, if you haven't already, smash that like button. Hopefully we get some good luck in these last four packs. We have seen a bit of a slower second half, I would say, but at the same time, very, very good. We have pulled that gold rare. Very exciting. Let's go with lightning energy. There we go, I didn't say leaf that time. Um, I hope that you guess the energies at home. I find it to just be a fun way of staying interactive. 
Um, now I'm doing this, so obviously I have to talk and whatnot. Lillipup and a Talonflame. Um, but as much as I want those big pulls, those awesome, awesome cards to show off to you and to show off in my collection, um, I want you all to be a part of it as well. So I think that, you know, guessing the energy, hopefully getting it right, just adds a little bit to it, you know? Um, hopefully it does add something for you. Let's go with psychic energy, dark energy. I should have said that. Um, in these last three packs, if we don't get a pull, I will, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Emolga and a Flapple. So yes, two packs left, both Sylveon. So hopefully, hopefully, that gives us some luck as it has given us luck in the past. I will I will say that. Two, three, four. Let's go with lightning. Leaf energy. Copycat. Skew. Again, looking for that Rayquaza. Only because I don't want to buy them. As much I mean I do want to buy them. A jump off and a Glaceon VMAX alternate art. We have pulled two alternate arts in one booster box this is absolutely insane oh my goodness i'm so sorry look at how beautiful this pikachu is oh my goodness it makes me want to open this other box like now but i can't oh my goodness the back is very good a little bit of smut but all good able to wipe it off Oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. Just take it in. You see, this is the card that's worth sitting here for a second, really showing it off, making sure that it's in the light for you all. Because it is just so beautiful. Oh, I want to break it out next to the other alternate art, but you should go watch that video if you haven't already. Oh my goodness, last pack magic. I don't know if I could take any more. If we happen to pull something crazy, I don't know. Uh, that's a green card, so there is nothing. I can't believe I just spoiled it for you all, but I will still go through it. An Entei and a Pinsir. And hey, with this card right here, again, I'm so happy we have pulled two alternate arts in one booster box. This is literally insane. But hey, thank you so much again for watching this. If you haven't already, hit that subscription button. And if you're looking for more, hit one of the videos on screen now, and you'll have plenty to watch. But enjoy the rest of your day and night whenever you get around to watching this. I will see you later.